Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're all doing well. So recently I've been looking through some old photos and I came across some photos from 2012 when me and my family went to the London 2012 Paralympic Games. And back then I was around seven years old. So I don't remember much about it, but there is some parts of it that I do remember. And if I remember correctly, before we actually went to the stadium to watch the athletics, we quickly looked at Buckingham Palace and that was our first time looking at it from the outside. And we took a family photo in front of a fountain nearby. And then we found some policemen who were letting children go on their own motorbikes and me being a seven year old back then I would find anything to be exciting so I gave it a go. I remember sitting on that motorbike and there's even a picture of it somewhere but I couldn't find it. So yeah, I probably saw a horse as well at some point. I don't remember seeing a horse but most of the times that I've been to London I at least see a horse and possibly stroke it as well because sometimes they do let you stroke some horses. Then we started heading towards the stadium and we came across a Paralympic gift shop so I asked if I could get something from there to bring with me to the stadium and remember that day by. So once we got in the stadium our seats were quite close to the front. We could see the wheelchair racing and I think the long jump. And the Olympic torch was quite close by. So that was fun to see. I was very excited about that when I first realised. I don't know why. I just was excited about it. And Back then I did not have a phone because I was too young to have a phone so I videoed and took photos on my Nintendo 3DS because that was my camera back then. And then at some point during the day we just walked around the local area and we came across a nice water feature that spelt words out of water. So that was quite fun to see. I just found it very satisfying as it was really well done. And the atmosphere that I felt in the stadium was crazy. As everyone was cheering their country on. And so it did get quite loud. Because especially the people behind me, they were like full on shouting. I don't blame them and it's a very big change to actually being there compared to watching it on TV. At least when you're watching it on TV you can turn down the volume whereas when you're there you can't really do much about it. And at one point one of the cameras that was filming the event for those at home, I saw them moving about and it was interesting to see how they were doing it. So I really enjoyed that day because it was an experience that doesn't come around that often. So I think that's why we did it. We were going to see the Olympics, but tickets were pretty much sold out. But I'm glad we saw the Paralympics because we got to see how resilient people are. They don't let disability define them. And those that have participated in the Paralympics, they're the true inspirations. So I am honoured to have gone and seen the London 2012 Paralympics. So that's all that I can remember from that day. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And on that note, I'll see you guys on the next one.